Right then, folks, here we go. We're going camping, Sean, aren't we? Yeah. We're going camping. Even though it is just for one night. And the reason being, it's going to be a little bit of a trial run, a little bit of a test run for our, our up and coming long trip that we've got planned for the back end of July going into August. So we've bought these wingman of the road tents and we're basically just going to have a, a try of them tonight and see what they're like. We've gone for the, the toucan, even though there's only going to be one person inside them, but we've gone for the toucan just for that little bit extra room over the uh, over the other one. What's the other one called, Sean? Uh, Left goose. Here. Goose, that's it, goose. So stick with us and uh, let's see how uh, things unfold. No, you're not getting that one either. Un <laughs> unfold. <laughs> God. <laughs> Wingman of the road, Tukin, on a Tiger 800. Feel all right? Yeah, it's all right. And similarly then, there's a wingman of the road, Tukin, on the back of a Tiger 1200. Gives you an idea, obviously, the size, the size of the tents on the on the bikes. Do you really want to camp out here? Uh, it's like wild things, Sean. Uh, these wild things are safe, though. Gonna be scary, you know. Uh, so that's our route then to uh, to the campsite for tonight. About five miles, I think. It looks it looks okay. Yeah. Until we get to the ford, we've got a little bit of a a river crossing. A little one, just a tiny little Ford. A tiny, tiny little Ford. Oh, the grass is nice. Yeah. The grass is smooth. <laughs> Maybe this is a bit of a fuff to turn off on this. Is this? Yeah. But it's off. I need to read the manual. I've just, I went into like ABS and I pressed the button and it just came straight back out of ABS. It's like, well, did I press the right button? So I had to go back in and try the other button.
should just be here somewhere, shouldn't it? I think so. We'll obviously take a look at it first, see how deep it is. It should be fine, I'm sure. Famous last words there. <laughs> it you should be fine. Well, you said it. <laughs> oh, yeah, God, there's not there. See a couple of rocks. There is a couple of rocks. These will be like some of the trails that they use for the, you know, the Kiel to 500 and the. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's a but one in Wales that they do as well. I'm sure there's one on the Isle of Man. Oh, is there? Um, yeah. Obviously uses uses the byways up there. Clear. Thank you. What's the what's the control amount like? The handlebar amount? All right, it's a lot bouncy, but it's okay. You can still see it, all right. Better than strapped to the tank. Oh god, yeah, massively. That was awful. Because <laughs> even when you wanted to get to it, you couldn't because all the straps and stuff were in the way. Yeah. At least this I can access it if I need to. That's it, that's the end of it. Well. So how far are we away? A mile, five minutes. Just a mile. A mile away from our campsite this evening. And then we'll find out just how easy it is to put these uh, these tents up. Yeah, that well, should be all right. Look at that, there's a bar open tonight, Sean. Seat's getting wrecked. 
Or lift your leg up. I'm trying. Recording. Right. Do you want to go? You can pick the spot. Oh, yes, it's alright. Let you do it. Me. Yeah. Right, so. Stonehof campsite. Uh, for information, they do take card payment, which is fab. It's a bit flatter, isn't it? A little bit flatter, yeah. Right, it's 10 to 4, so this is obviously just a time reference, and we'll just see how long it does take to get the tents off the bike and get them set up. 10 to 4. Well, wow, what a disaster. So, for a trial run, <sighs> our trial run, we've had a, we've had a pole snap uh, on our first, on our first attempt. So, it's half past four, so there's 40 minutes. Uh, with a repair of sorts. Um, so basically, what we've done, we've put a we've put a a tent peg inside the pole just to try and give it some rigidity, but it has bent straight away again. Uh, so hopefully wingman of the road if you're watching we'll be contacting you shortly via email or telephone or pigeon to try and get that replaced if we'd have uh, yeah if there was no repair they'd have been up pretty quickly
40 minutes with a repair. And I cut myself. Hotels from now on, I think, Sean. <laughs> right, let's get the stoves ready. Yeah, cup of coffee.